It's well documented that I think the box selection policy as it pertains to overseas based players is a joke. This is a professional sport, but the box selectors continue to treat those many highly competent men who often apply their trade abroad like naughty schoolboys, sending them to the corner and forcing them to watch the good boys play. This topic is relevant again because the box go on tour in a couple of weeks and once again the best available side wasn't selected. And it's not only the foreign boys who can feel our done by. Locally based boys like Rowan Jans van Rensburg, Nizam Kaur, who I thought were very good throughout the season, were overlooked for players who are clearly inferior in the form of Damien De Lenda and Uze Kassim. And I'm not saying that all foreign based players should trump locally based options. That would be ridiculous. But how do you select a Springbok side to tour the Northern Hemisphere and omit a player like Franz Stein, for instance? It's crazy. Kutsi maintains that he selects his sides on merit. There's always opinion in selection. But the performance of those that he has and continues to select is still in question. Let's look at the facts. Kutsi has gone 5 from 9 this season, a season in which he hasn't beaten Australia or New Zealand. He's 9 from 21 overall. That's a mediocre return by any standard. I think there's room for more foreign based selections. And just to stir debate, I've selected a 15 that I think can give the current box a run for their money. At fullback, I got an option on Gio Aplon or Valele Roo, but my pick is Jason Colby. Volta on the right wing, Francois Alcott. I've always thought he's a better wing than he is a scrum off. On the left wing, I'm going with the veteran Brian Abana. I could have gone with Louis Ludi. In my midfield, Franz Stein and Paul Jordan would tear Damien Dialenda and Jesse Krill to shreds. Mona Stein beats out Pat Lambert Flower for me. I got options at Scrum Off. Faf de Klerk, Kobus Reinach, probably top of my list, but I'm going with Juan Pina at number 9. Going for Melin anchors my back row with Kalk Berger and Vian Liebenberg at blind and open side flank respectively. My locks are going to get smoked. Jean-André Kreer and Flip van der Merwe are the best of a very small pool of second rowers playing abroad. Rounding out my 15, Bismarck Duplessis, Gertrude Steenkamp and Marcel van der Merwe in my front row. There's a list of names that I haven't mentioned. Among them, Jean Dysel, Willem Alberts and JP Peterson. But I want to know what you think. Pick the foreign based box you think could beat the current 15 and put it in the comments below.